the 3D printer. What's really great about this model is its price. It's priced at under $1,000. This is a pretty cheap 3D printer in the scheme of things. You're not usually finding ones under like a grand. What's great about this one also is that you can print in two colours. So you can see on the sides here that you've got the cartridges loaded up. Now it can print in ABS or PLA plastic. The difference with this model compared to previous iterations of the Cube is that they have the print head attached to the spool when you buy it. So the good thing about that is that if there's a likelihood of any kind of jams in the print head while you're printing, which when you look at the fibres, they're quite small, they do float around, you'll be getting a new print head when you buy a new spool. So basically it's like starting afresh. Now this model here is printing in layers that are 75 microns thick. Um, you can see it's a little bit liney, but that's very comparable when you consider what the MakerBot Mini can do, which is actually a little bit higher than that. I think it's that's 100 microns. So as I said before, this Cube 3D printer is expected to cost less than $1,000 and it's due to be launching around the springtime this year. You will be able to get it in the UK, it just depends on stockist or whether you'll have to get it shipped over. Also, when you're buying a spool of plastic, that will cost you around $50. So that's the Cube 3D printer. But if you want to find out more about 3D printing products at CES, go to witch.co.uk. on what is a 3D printer and more from CS 2014.